Hello everybody and welcome once again to Surviving with Blood Magic. I'm looking, looking up there, I don't see why. You see in my hand I've got some stone and what I did is I added salt touch to the um, bound pickaxe. I wasn't sure whether it would actually work, but it does. Let's have a look at this. So I basically did one of those big bangs and I got <laughs> found diamonds, picked up the diamonds and so we got stone instead of cobblestone, which is quite useful I think. So I'm ready to go off to the end again. I also got some sponges. I did find the sponge room in, in that thing. Not sure what I'm going to do with it. Maybe I'll just clear it out over the weekend or something. A bit of fun. Um, maybe I won't do the whole thing. Just do the rooms inside. So we're off to the stronghold again. And we're going back to the end. So we'll do that now. And we shall just trundle off there. And we've got, we've got my building blocks. We've got it right the right way, of course. Which I've forgotten what it is. There we are. I'm just wondering which was the best way to do this. We'll just teleport down here. Actually, I think I'll block that off just in case. <laughs> you never know. It might one day I might be in a bit of a rush. Tell you what, I could do with some ender pearls. So let's just get some ender pearls. One, two, two, three. No, oops, I think I've gone up four there. Let's just break one of these down like that. Let's have a look at some of these guys. I think they must be around to be annoyed, right? Good, yes, it's good. So we'll take the um, this this uh, sword because it's got um, luck three on it, I think, or fortune fortune three. Come on, thank you. No, you can't teleport away. I've got my end of severance. Well, they're not being uh, very helpful today, are they? Come on. Oh, I haven't turned on my magnet. I'll do that. Before I forget, we'll just turn this one on. So we pick up the pearls. Uh, I kept calling this one the wrong name. This is a teleposition signal. It's basically, it's a teleport one. So, like that. And I've also added into here some uh, strong legs. Because strong legs are actually quite handy. Come on. I want to see you. Come on. Right. Thank you. Fairly unfair way of getting endermen, but uh, don't really care. They're annoying sometimes, aren't they? There we go. I think that'll do for now. How many have I got? 19. That's plenty for the time being. You can always do that again if you want. I'm getting strong legs on that, so there we go. So now, over here, I think I saw one of those little portal things to get off the main island onto the other one um, but I'm not sure exactly where I saw it it's certainly around one of the edges why oh, I got my air signal with me yes I have good ah oh, there we are really <laughs> It's that far away from the void. My goodness, this is unusual. Right, we've got to get our way up there. I hope I've got enough. If I haven't, I'm going to have to build some more, aren't I? Tell you what, I'll slowly pull myself up there and I'll see you in a few seconds. Well, I got to him. I actually had to go back because I haven't got any way. So, of course, I can fly. But what I, I did, I didn't bring any, was any wood. So I thought maybe that's a good thing to bring. So, here we go. So here we are at the other end of this thing, so I'll make a mark on this one. I'll just make a quick mark here, so I'll call it Mini Portal. Number two, I think, and we'll just make that green and save that. Uh, and that's where we come out, so let's go and explore. So here we've come, we've got some fruit here, so maybe we'll just take and remove that from my hand. I don't need any pills in my hand while I'm doing this. Um, Chorus fruit. I'm not sure if we've got any uses for chorus fruit, but let's break some. See, let's see if we get anything useful for that. Let's have a look at the uses of this. Oh, we can make some popped chorus fruit, and the uses for that is well, we can make some purple blocks and some end rods if we need to make any end rods. That's not too bad. But nothing special for um, blood magic anyway. So let's have a look. A few endermen around here. Let's just go up a little bit. Let's just pillar up a little bit and get up. See, I used. I went back. I got another stack of uh, sto stones. I should hold shift when I'm jumping. If I hold shift while I'm jumping, 
it's not a big deal so I'm having a quick look over here that's the portal which has come out of well I don't see any in cities from here but there must be one or two around we just have to pillar our way across these um, blocks over here I guess so I shall just explore a little bit and when I find something interesting I shall come back again well I'm back <laughs> that took a bit of fun I can tell you that for nothing you can see here I am and I've got a marker over there because I could mark it from here and you basically I've been all the way down here around here all done all this explored this here come right down through there and back so you can I basically been pillaring across from the mini portal to here <laughs> wow it took a long time anyway it's time to go and get going with the swing isn't it so let's have a go what do I need for this particular thing I've been using the pickaxe but the pickaxe doesn't work the bound pickaxe doesn't work with the right click here on the end stone it just doesn't do anything but it works fine on stone but it it works fine it's just I have to do other bits and pieces so we'll get the bow out and we'll probably and I've also got here let's have a look my air signal I'm going to need that because we are doing this in terms of as it would be done in with um, blood magic equipment anything blood magic or related we will use have a quick look around I'm looking for some shurikens shurikens I can hear one there oops I'm not damaging him I got him in the end <laughs> of course we've got a bit of levitation now oh, there's no one down there we have got full damage protection that's one thing we have got probably could shoot this as well for that matter yeah oops anyway we can fly up here it's no big deal <laughs> another one where's that one gone to there'll be a one up here won't there maybe it's better to take the the sword i'm wondering which one probably the yes we'll use the but this one because it's the it's got luck on it it gives us a better chance of getting shirt shirk and shells we haven't got any yet so that's there's always one around here let's have a look i can use this for going up I do take a bit of damage from these, of course, but it's generally minor. Well, we've got enough food. We've got some regen powders with us as well. Potions with us. Oh, there's one. That time I did get one. And another one over here. So we've found the first ender chest and some useful stuff in here. Let's have a look. Now that's great because we've actually got our first sugar shell. Now where did I pick up the second one? Yes, I have. Good. So that means all we need to do now is we can take this. Is it can I, is it useful to take this? It's going to fill up my inventory a bit, but we can do that no problem. In fact, I've got a crafting table there. I went back and got a crafting table as well. <laughs> Strange that. So we will make a we'll make a sugar box. I think. We'll, as quickly as we can and then at least we've got something to carry stuff around with us as an extra carrying bit so to speak so we can put that we'll break this now I don't need this one crafting table that is <laughs> wrong one never mind <laughs> try again so we could put loads of stuff into this we'll put the ender pearls in here we'll put the weak blood shards in here i need the arrows just in case i'll put one of these two regents away uh, one of them actually double cl shift click push both in don't need that that and that with us on the mo at the moment so now we can we've got soap touch on this pickaxe so we can break this without just getting back cobblestone and we can break this well so we can put the ender chest away in here and we can put the diamond and breaking smelting in sight too and what was the other one a sharpness for one curse vanishing that's not so useful so break that with this and we have the box and we can carry on exploring this so i know there's a boat here because i saw a boat but it's in a bit of a bad position 
We'll take these bars with us as well. So we some end and whatever they're called. <laughs> and I'm not going to go and park you park her up this because I don't need to. So we can use the uh, the air seal. But in fact, while I'm here, let's eat a bit. You may have noticed I also got another. If I didn't say so already, when I uh, when I restarted the game because I, you have to regen to get your hearts back, I got all these hearts back. So yeah, seagulls are number five like this. It's not going to be so easy, is it? If we get in the middle or in the corners, it won't be difficult to getting up here at all. A little bit further forward here, like that, and then we probably. If I get in the right position, I should be able to go right to the top. I get to the top here, and there's a the guy. Wait a few seconds for the levitation to disappear. It doesn't take too long normally. We've got some banners. The end rods are useful for lighting things up, if you didn't know already. There's the boat is over here. Well, I suppose the easiest way to go and get to the... Actually, is that the boat? No, the boat is separate. So we'll go... Oh, yes, there's the boat. I can see the boat. So we'll use, the, we'll use fly to the boat, I think. Probably the easiest way to get here, because this is where we've got the interesting bits and pieces. Let's get this... Actually, let's get the sword out. Nope. And here we've got Electra, that's what we actually came in for. Is there, is there another one of those around here? Of course, these chests are usually interesting as well. It's got the diamond equipment in here. If you're playing vanilla Minecraft, of course we're not. So let's put down the shulker box again. I'll make another one of these soon as well. As soon as we get our next one. I oh, don't need that. Probably don't need the ends to put the stuff away. Put the end rods away and put the coarse fruit away and we'll break these two boxes here. And then we'll put what we found in there. There's a diamond armor. Iron ingots. And a beetroot seed. <laughs> Less useful, but we'll take this one. So now we've got sky's the limit. So let's have a look at the use of this one. I'm pretty sure I can put this onto a chest plate. I'm just having a think. I'm pretty sure I've seen it on a chest plate. Anyway, I'll figure it out. In the meantime, we'll just take the box but back with us. And I will see you. I'm probably not going to do all of this on camera now because it's all the same. Once we've got to this stage, I actually didn't pick up those, did I? What did we get? Instant health too, that's good. Right, I'll see you in a short while when I get back to base. Well, I finished here. So let's <laughs> click the teleposition signal and we come straight back home. As quick as that. Actually, I got quite a lot of stuff. So, well, I say a lot. Reasonable lot of stuff. So we've got a couple of uh, shulker boxes. And I think I've actually got... Let's have a look what we've got inside those. So I've got another shulker shell in that one. And another two in this one. So I can make another, another box. In fact, that was a lot. I didn't get any more than those three. It wasn't as good as the ones that are in the end cities that I've been to in uh, Real Tech Mod. But mod pack but it's not bad not going to complain i don't really have that much of use for these except for it's a sort of a portable storage mm, which is great of course <laughs> not something that actually exists in um blood magic as it happens so let's put everything in fact let's put everything that we consolidate everything we've got actually so we've got quite a few ender pearls as well which is good because i did include mob grinding utilities as you can see and i want to make some of these I would like to make six, so we need 24 ender pearls for that. So, what do I need? Obsidian. I need um, six 12s, 12 obsidian. Of course, that's not going to be a big deal. I can break that here. In fact, this is probably not the best pickaxe for that. 
let's use the one with efficiency five on it uh oh oh that's one i actually got from okay good that was one of the ones i got from the, the places the efficiency five one this breaks it fairly quickly so we'll quickly make one of these up I'm, I'm sure i can use the electra on the somewhere in here i'm sure i saw it what i also saw that i haven't found yet was the refill potion there should be a refill potion because when i was playing with the night vision one it ran out so i've got an empty flask of night vision potion but i'm not sure how to refill it but there must be a way or maybe there's a few things which have disappeared from the mod which is a bit of a shame like elementals and these demons i can't i don't know why they haven't been re reintroduced to the pack because i'm not sure even why they took them out so let's have a look i wanted to make these things didn't i redstone i need so we need six redstone i've got eight wrong one let's do that again because i did create an absorption hopper uh modifier radius plus one and it's over there it's over where the um ender portal is uh, not the ender portal it's over where the ocean monument is going to look at that there is something else i haven't shown you either i'm not sure i've got time for it let me have a quick look one thing i have done over here is to turn this off and on the reason for that is it the number of these was disappearing and i'm sure it's something related to um have we got any more in there no it's finished i'm sure it's related to going out of um, unloading the chunks because we're actually in a loaded chunk area here we'll just put those up like that and fill it up again you'll also notice that i did change this to uncover this particular crystal but it doesn't seem to work anymore it's one of the nice features <laughs> so i actually had eight so there'll be one in there and there should be uh, hopefully there's more than eight in here seven <laughs> right not quite so good but it should in fact uh, have at least eight in there villages as you might notice are increasing like crazy <laughs> and of course you can get a horse in a minecart something i did notice in fact let's have a look have i got a boat here i usually got a boat around here but you can also put a minecart in a boat oh, i didn't know that i was trying to do it the other way around of course that doesn't work <laughs> let's just pick up this one you can see i was being playing with minecarts here so let's just put this boat down here like that but i think you can even put it on the track take a minecart here's one let's not let's not use that pick let's use the other one it doesn't do any damage and i don't really need it for anything else and you can put a minecart in the boat the reason um how did i get it in last time i do know what i did let's put the minecart down here and push it into the it went the wrong way of course it did i pushed it and at the end of the line there was a boat uh, i had put a boat to catch the cow there we go so now <laughs> so now this minecart's in this boat here and i'm not sure if we can get into it still oh yes, of course we've got this station here if i can do that unfortunately you can't <laughs> what you can't do with this is um oh, maybe i can get into it can i get into it yes i can get into it and i'm actually in the boat because you see i'm rowing <laughs> that's interesting it actually turns around let's try that so that was a w no s oops press the wrong button and what happened is anyway so oops sorry let's get out of here what happened is i i was doing a, uh, i was basically trying to move a, a cow over here and i basically set it up so i had a minecart so it catch the cow as it came out of the um, pen and i put um, some rails and at the end of the rails i had a boat and the boat and the minecart ended up in the boat when it went into the water it sank <laughs> not very useful anyway let's go over here i think i'll go the quick way this time like that in fact you can hear there's a this might have some stuff in i've actually always oh, it has good because i did put some chunk loaders down here or some spot loaders 
but I also put down in here actually down underneath the ground didn't I this thing and it's got anything in it no it hasn't let's just increase the area of this and you can show the area of course it should be quite a large area now so it should yes I think it's a large area I can't see it in fact I just picked something up what did I pick up some ink sacks so maybe it's not working as well as I was hoping it's going to work but we can also put a chest on top of it let's do that oh yes I haven't got my um <laughs> I haven't got my sickle of elementary affinity with me at the moment um so I'm losing some air so let's have a look which side is that so that's the west side so any items should go into there like that let's just put something oh yes there you go put those in there they go into that that's fine and you'll see my eyes going down just come in here a bit and you'll get the air back as normal again yes yeah, so i did say so i put some chunk loaders down or spot loaders down so it would actually run when i'm not here that's a funny color oh yes of course because i turned on the the absorption hopper didn't i so you see i put one down here and one above because each spot is 16 16 by 16 by 16 um let me just turn this off again hide the area otherwise things will look funny let me just go back in our boat actually i hear one of them something splashing around somewhere it's not in the boat so anyway you can see the one there so let's get out of here Well, that's it for this episode. You'll notice the dragon's head, I forgot about this. You put it on some, a block which is powered by redstone, redstone block, of course, it's a pretty good start. It does that with its mouth. <laughs> anyway, I hope you've enjoyed this episode. Until next time, I wish you all the best. I'm not sure what we're going to be now because we're coming fairly near to the end of the series. There's a few more rituals we can do. I think we'll set up those because they're interesting to do uh, and there's a lot of stuff that doesn't exist anymore which is a shame and stuff that isn't you can't build let's have a quick look at this actually because if i um do that one if i come over here and get rid of this you'll see all of these plinths and, and these you can do but these you can't do there's no there's no recipes for pillars and you can't do any of these things in here like this different types of pillars we've done all of that stuff We've done those. These are just decorative blocks as far as I can I can see, which is basically glowstone with polished destructive stone, which is basically destructive stone, which is basically one destructive crystal with some stone. Produces 16 of those. So sort of a good return in terms of stone anyway, building blocks. So you can do all of these things, and these are walls, which we can also do because there's a polished stone again. But that's more mostly decorative stuff, isn't it? We've done all of this. We've done bloodstone brick. Well, I actually haven't done bloodstone bricks, but they're just basically blood, blood bloodstone tiles into four, um, and all of this stuff tiled worn stone path. We've done the tiled brick path, tiled stone path, the worn stone. Oh, maybe there's just a what's the difference between those? Okay, four of those makes one of those, and the same with obsidian tile stuff. We've done the routing stuff. Uh, we've done tanks, or we've got a little bit of the way of tanks. I can't find a way. We've done all of the orbs, so that's good. We've done these. We can, that's creative, obviously. We're not going to be doing that one. But there's a few bits we've done lava crystals, and the, we haven't done all of the blood um, bound tools. We've done these. We've done a few of these. An altar maker, okay, for debugging only. Uh, living boots, we've done those. Sentinel armor, we've done that. This one you can't do, as far as I can understand, because there's no way to get a demon blood shard. There's no information on it, and its uses is to make one of these demonic telepo teleposition focus, which was the seven by seven by seven block. We haven't done all of these things because I'm not sure that they're needed particularly. And we haven't actually managed to get any of those. We just get demonic will. We haven't got any corrosive will. But don't think there's any uses for this. Let's look. No, there's no use for any of these. 
just the just demonic will to make the the altar which you get easily enough and then we've done that we've done we've done the manual scroll of icarus what's the recipe for that one does it have a recipe no it doesn't have a recipe and with these things you don't have recipes that one does a potion flask as we know um i wonder i wonder if we can actually refill that let's just try that next time so until then bye for now